Okay, this is Mike Barnes, and uh, I'm uh, uh, broadcasting this from our factory. Uh, this is a little bit of an update on uh, the Edge book, and uh, right now uh, we're showing uh, Linux. Uh, we did have a demo of Linux before, and uh, I wanted to give a little bit of an update. This is still Watt OS. Uh, we've been working on it uh, very hard to try to uh, make it as good as we possibly can. Now, in the last uh, video, uh, we showed that we had uh, numeric uh, for uh, spreadsheets and Abbey Word uh, for word processing. Users have the option of loading OpenOffice if they prefer. Uh, we didn't want to load down uh, uh, the system with OpenOffice because uh, we're running on eight gigabyte of storage. So what we've done instead is we've only loaded the presentation portion of it. So here we've got uh, basically uh, uh, a PowerPoint uh, clone, which is Open Office Empress, and then uh, we have Abbey Word for Microsoft Word, and we have Numeric. So it's a full uh, office suite, but we're keeping this uh, well under four gigabytes. We're up at around uh, 2.5, 2.3 gigabytes right now. I also wanted to show that uh, uh, we've included the ed, uh, uh, we've included the ebook uh, capability on here. This is FB Reader, which is open source. And uh, I've downloaded a free book uh, from uh, the Gutenberg uh, uh, project. So this is um, uh, a, a one of uh, many, many books that are available that you can download for free. Uh, you can use this as a very low cost way of, of reading books that can be used in uh, education for distributing e-textbooks. Uh, another thing that I wanted to show is, is that this system is primarily uh, used for email, browsing, word processing, and light tasks. But I wanted to show that uh, we have uh, the browser up here able to uh, use uh, pretty sophisticated uh, tools on the network. This is, for example, is Google Docs. And um, if I, uh, I, I've got, I can bring up, I can store files on, on uh, Google Docs like spreadsheets and word processing. And uh, so let me go ahead and um, uh, bring up uh, one of these uh, pages here, and uh, it's just downloading it off the web, and uh, uh, you can see here that we can uh, uh, use the browser uh, quite effectively to uh, work with uh, Google Docs or any other web-based, uh, cloud-based application uh, like, uh, like this. Um, you can use it for uh, Yahoo tools or any of the other ones that are out there. So here we are, we're loading the PDF document, uh, we're really uh, using the bandwidth here rather than uh, the CPU speed. But here we are, you can see that we're bringing up um, uh, our document uh, in Google Docs. And uh, once again, I'd like to point out that uh, we have a very good screen here. I can adjust the brightness up or down. It's uh, quite bright, it's 400 nits, so it's actually brighter than most laptop um, screens. Okay, so anyway, this is a little bit more of an update on uh, the Linux. Uh, please uh, email if you have questions. Uh, I'll be glad to answer them for you. Uh, we'll, we're coming out uh, a little later this month. Uh, $200 or $199.95 is the end user price. We're looking for dealers. We're looking for opportunities to sell the school systems. We have these available in kit format so that uh, we can get the price way down uh, for people who want to assemble them themselves. Uh, so anyway, look forward to hearing from you.